He's out of bounds, but it's all over. The caravan of Mount Carmel, you see the storm across the field. The city championship. They've done it. Mount Carmel, the state champions. Hennessy looking on. Lots of congratulations. That's it. It's over. We told the kids if we didn't beat ourselves, we could do anything we really had to do in this game today. We've been in the state championship now for the last five years. And I don't think anybody's done what these kids have done. And it's a championship from Mount Carmel. It is four in a row. Time is that is going to do it. The Mount Carmel Caravan, they took care of what they felt was unfinished business from one year ago. They lost by a field goal in 1995. They win at 17-6 over Joliet Catholic. On behalf of our entire football program, I'd like to congratulate you on becoming the all-time winningest coach in Illinois State history. As you know, my friend, uh, we've had a special relationship going way back when to Coach Walker and I coming by to see you at the house, to uh, the great times that I've had on road trips with one of your best, Mike McGrew, to now having Adam Cushing on our staff. Uh, the leadership, the mentorship, and the friendship that you've provided me. Not only myself, but our football program forever being dead too. So big hearty congratulations on behalf of our entire football family. Uh, you've earned it and I know you'll never take the credit for it. You'll give the credit to the young man and to your staff but uh, for once can you take a little bit of credit and enjoy this and uh, congratulations coach from all the Wildcats. Go Cats and again congratulations. Coach Frank, Gab Cushing, how are you buddy? Uh, congratulations on uh, winning 307. Real proud of you. Obviously uh, I can speak on behalf of all the former players. We're all proud to have been part of it, but again, it's all uh, because of you. Um, everything you've done for all of us, uh, we can't thank you enough for, for me personally in my career coaching football, the, the friend and mentor that you've been, I appreciate it. Thanks again, congratulations, and uh, looking forward to number four, Mike. It was all hard work, determination, goal setting. Uh, and he was also a, a guy that uh, continued to push me to be the best of what I did. Mentally, I think, you know, it prepares you obviously for life and, and things that you'll be faced with moving on, uh, you know, for you. Coach Lenny, congratulations. Dave Dorn here in Northern Illinois. Just want to tell you, you've been the standard for so many of us in this profession and, and such a great guy um, and motivator uh, to the youth, to the young guys, the guys we've coached, to the coaches that come through. We've always handled everything with such respect and uh, what you've given back to the game that I know has given you so much uh, for me has been a staple and a standard for what I want to become in, in this profession so congratulations to you Mount Carmel to all your players for such a great bar that you set in this profession and being an all-time winningest coach in Illinois history and I know there's going to be a, a long long period of time before that record goes down and I know it's more about the kids and the game than it is anything for you. So I just want to say thanks and congratulations to you from myself, from my staff, and from all the Huskies out there. First of all, congratulations. There are not a lot of coaches out there that can do the things that you've done. And obviously that's a compliment to you, your staff, and your school, and all the great players that you've had. When I first came to the University of Illinois, I was told that if I was going to recruit Chicago, that the first person I needed to get in contact with was Frank Lenti. 
Obviously, I'd had the opportunity and pleasure of meeting you back in the early 90s when we used to go on the Glazer clinics together. But, uh, you know, your, your success precedes you. Uh, everybody in this country knows Frank Letty. Anybody that you ever talk about, talk to about recruiting the city of Chicago will ask about Frank Letty. And I think, uh, obviously, your, your record, uh, not only your record, but the players, the type of players, the people that you've produced, uh, not only uh, successful football players, but more importantly, successful people, is something that uh, you, know, you should be very, very proud of. Congratulations. Uh, I can honestly say that I uh, probably won't ever reach that, uh, that record, but uh, I'm honored and privileged to, to be able to know the person and call the person that has done it a good friend. Congratulations, Coach. Hey, Dad. Sorry I couldn't be there tonight, but just want to take this opportunity to congratulate you on the record. I know it's been one of your goals for a couple years now, and I'm just extremely happy that you were finally able to reach the mark. I uh, just want to take the opportunity to congratulate also the current and former staff members that may be here tonight, along with current and former players. You'll be the first person to deflect all the credit to them. I uh, also just want to take the opportunity just to let people know as good of a coach and teacher you might be, you're even a better father, and I'm extremely appreciative of all the things you've done for me over the years. Wouldn't be where I'm at today with, without you and Mom. Uh, so just, I love you, and hopefully uh, we'll get to see you next week. Frank Lenti, over 28 years and 363 games, he's coached more than 2,500 football players. Scores have gone on to college football, dozens have earned scholarships, Nine have pursued careers in the NFL. More important, they become husbands, fathers, and citizens who remember his lessons, that hard work works, that it's never about me, always about we, that they should be good people and good students, and only then will it matter if they are good athletes. 28 years of loyalty to coaches, the faculty, the Carmelites, to Mount Carmel High School, 28 years, 19 league championships, nine state championships, a record total of 309 victories, and he's just getting started.